been traveling here in Pakistan for a little while now and uh, my pathetic attempt of growing a beard has uh, come to this result but it just looks unclean and untidy and I want to look uh, nice and sharp but uh, I just noticed this barber shop here on the, uh, on the side of the, the main street here in the beautiful mountains of Baltistan where the call to prayer is coming out of the mosque and these uh, amazing cars and trucks and motorbikes are passing down this, uh, this road here and um, yeah I want to get a nice shave so I can feel very fresh and uh, very good but um, yeah I just uh, seen something, uh, some, um, just seen a nice barber shop here Assalamu alaikum bhai Ah, up kiss here? Acha. Um you are uh you are uh, shaving? Uh, you, you you are shaving? Oh uh can I have uh, one sh a one shave? Yes. Uh, acha? Okay. Assalamu alaikum. A kiss here? Acha acha. Okay. Um well I'll just uh let's put my bag uh here. Sunglasses, I don't need. Okay, let's uh, wanna <laughs> So, hopefully, no killing on this one. <laughs> okay, so, um, uh, shaving, um, this and this, but, um, this, uh, I, I, I like. So, this, um, um, keep uh, only shaving here. Uh, Janti hai? Okay, I hope so. Okay. Acha? Me babar azam hu. Yak nam ke hai bhai? Ashaf. Ashaf. Ashaf, the great Baltistan Baba. Ye kya aap balti hai? There are lots of different people in this region. There are um, many people. Okay, oh there we go, nice. Okay, so he's just preparing the creams. Last time they said I should ask for a fresh blade. Um, blade um, fresh? Okay. Good news that he's only uh, putting the cream on my uh, beard area. He kidnapped kidna years, uh, this bit, uh, five years or one years? One year, okay. So it's a fairly new shop. So he's uh, rubbing in this cream. Hi, oh, you have a friend. Hello. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Kaise hai? Bilkul. Haan. Main hariyat se hoon. Haan. Shukriya bhai. Okay, we're getting a nice cream. This one I have like a full... In India I didn't have the full um, mirror, so I couldn't see anything. But this time, I do. And uh... Hopefully, I don't get anything in my eyes on this one. Oh, there's a there's a fly on my head. But uh, this is um, this is what it's like getting a shave here in northern Pakistan. We got some nice Christmas lights here. I'm sure they're not for Christmas. I'm excited for this shave. Feel nice and fresh afterwards. Well, we've got all the cream on. See, when I shave at home, I don't spend much time. Uh, Rubbing the cream in, but well, they they do that here, and maybe I should be doing that as well. Might stop getting so many cuts and stuff.
Okay, well, mm -hmm. that's the cream all done. Good. I'm trying not to talk as much this time, because last time I uh, I ended up having a terrible fear, didn't I? Where I, uh, I got all sorts in my mouth and in my eyes, and it was uh, an all-round uh, stressful experience. But this one should be more relaxing, I think. These kind, kind people here in Baldistan, Pakistan. It's a good old traditional barber shop. I like it. And uh, here's the blade. Oh, he's got a very nice moustache. Oh, good, good moustache. Um, I am trying myself, <laughs> but uh, still, still growing after maybe five years. Ah, me, 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 ne isam cha maaki je. Very gentle with the blade. It's never good when you go to a barber's and they kind of overdo it. You know, and they, they try to um, do it too fast or try to show their skills a bit. But this guy's been very gentle, very precise. And only, uh, only one year's experience. They're just getting photos with the uh, gentleman. Raise my neck so it doesn't cut. Yeah, He's doing a very good job already. Hello, She's making videos with the man. Pakistani. Sindabad. Pakistani. Hello. 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 We're happy to be out in the uh, beautiful region of Skardu, following a few days of sickness, <laughs> getting a clean shave. I don't want to jinx it, but so far no cuts, I don't think. Maybe a couple little ones. This is video. Hey, hey, just become the center of attention. <laughs> what am I now? <laughs> Well, like I always say, just like I said in the last Street Shave video, you really learn to trust the place when you uh, come to a new country, a new city, in a rural area, and pay a man to take a blade to your neck. And I think that's the best way of describing how you need to get out of your comfort zone and, uh, and just see new things, you know? See the unknown, meet the new people, and just see how your everyday working man is so friendly. Okay, Allah Hafiz, bye. It's going uh, for round two just to uh, clean off any of the bits that he wasn't able to get. And now on this side. <laughs> It's getting all of the details in, all of the small areas that often get neglected.
Na is a top quality chef here in northern Pakistan. You don't need to go to a fancy place in London or all of these places. Anywhere. The barber's got experience. You can get a very lovely shave. Oh, he's cleaning up. Cleaning. Being very, very precise, which I appreciate a lot. Putting the hair on the ear now. <laughs> Wonder if they know how to do a skin fade here. <laughs> that one I might doubt. Lowering the headrest now. Okay. He's cutting the back of my hair with scissors. It's the first time for that. my uh, barber at home comes to do a skin fit, he's going to be very confused about uh, why the bottom part is a, a very different length and scissor cut. <laughs> Reminds me of an old English barbers, you know, when you've got like a traditional British barbers, almost everything is with scissors, you know. They, uh, whereas in like a Turkish barber or whatever that we normally go to, uh, which are very common in cities in England, um, everything's with like four different types of uh, electric uh, shavers and, and all the rest of it. He's actually, it looks like he's going to do some shaving, I can see, on the, uh, the back sides of the hair. So I'm interested in this. I've never had this before with a uh, with shave. Let's see, uh, let's see what happens. I might need you to uh, film this yeah. bit because I, uh, I wasn't expected uh, to see from behind. Unless he's just literally doing the sides by the ear. In that case, that would be very normal. Mm -hmm. flies dropping on me. <laughs> this is a nice, nice place, friendly people. On the street here in Skardu, on the main street. Okay. I'm going to be so fresh after this. Now on the other side. And no, normally you can't see um, like what's happening behind you until they show you the small mirror that you get in a traditional barber shop at home. But, uh, Looks like he's kind of like shaping up the back. I'm getting a, maybe this is Pakistani style. And, uh, maybe there's some antiseptic for afterwards, we'll see. I love the fact that he's using scissors on the back of my hair. It's like uh, unbelievably short. It was like literally a, a week ago, it was a complete zero grade skin fade. <laughs> Dialed in and focused. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna close my eyes this time. <laughs> Maybe he's cutting, cutting the hair also? We'll see. <laughs> I've never had a hair cut. Oh, I opened my mouth. Yeah, I made the mistake of opening my mouth when he did that, even though I said I wouldn't. Ah. 
that ciproflaxin might come in handy after uh, taking in a squirt of that uh, <laughs> of that spray there. Ah, nice head massage. Ah, thank you to Paige, lovely camera woman there. Ah, this is the best part about South Asian barbers. Bahatachi, <laughs> shukriya bhai. Bahatachi. Whoa. Now we're getting jet lag. Jet lag? I mean, whiplash. <laughs> My brain's not working because uh, of the trauma it's receiving. But they seem to do that move a lot where they kind of lock their fingers together and uh, smash your head in. So it must have some positive effects that they've learned over the years and generations of, uh, of doing this. Now he's styling the hair. Very nice. Always get the comb over, so I'm like a 1920s Wall Street banker. Ah, there we go. So clean now. Look at that. Is that a good shave? Bahot acha. Bahot bahot shukriya bhai. Shukriya. Okay, and that's it. We are shaved, we've had it on the back, on the sides, had head massage, everything. That's uh, very, very nice. He um, he kidnapped up by for a haircut here in Baltistan. Panso. Uh, Panso, five, 500. Okay, actually. Okay. We'll, uh, we'll give him a tip because, uh, yeah, he deserves a tip. Yeah, let's see what do we have. Okay. Can you hold that for me one second? Oh, He's very, uh, very precise, very kind guy, very gentle, and uh, even give the the head massage as well, you know. So uh, let's see. It's 500 for the head, but we'll give 5,000. That's a uh, very, very kind guy. Okay, 5,000 for you, Acha. Okay, this is for you because you are um, Bahot Achi um, Baba. Okay, very good Baba. Okay, Bahot Shukriya Bhai. Shukriya. Okay, but. Uh, Yes, I appreciate this so much. I'm feeling fresh. I feel good. Yes, after one week of no shaving, I'm much appreciated. Okay? Uh, maybe you can uh, give somebody free uh, shave next time. Okay, inshallah, bye. Okay, Allah Havis. Ravis. Okay, what a lovely guy. Well, I feel fresh in this lovely sunny day. But, uh, Thanks for watching this video of me getting a northern Pakistani shave here in the Baltistan region of Pakistan. And uh, yeah, thank you so much. If you like this video, please leave a like and subscribe for uh, more videos from beautiful Pakistan. And you can go back and watch past videos as well. But yeah, thanks so much. Please subscribe. Goodbye.